Uh, what? That was, that was odd. Hello and welcome back to No Man's Sky. I'm still on my paraffinium world and in fact, we should collect some, huh? So let's grab this and we'll see how much I've got. Pull into my cargo. There we go. 4,701. Looking good. Chlorine, that one's a... Oh. I'm going to have to figure out about chlorine, though. Hello? Hello? Oh. Oh, it's you. Okay. Yeah, so... Ah. Uh, interesting base here but you know what I didn't do I didn't rename this I didn't upload it so this one since this is on the planet with pretty bones that's what it's called so let's accept and upload the base all right so I need to go to the other pretty bones and delete it so I may as well go through here and uh, let's see if I can find it. It says current system. This is this is the other one. So let's warp there. All right, we're here. And um, okay, the ship doesn't seem to be partially inside, so it seems to be okay. Oh, what? Huh. Oh, it's over there now. Interesting how it parks over there. All right, so we are going to be deleting this base. Now we do have the neighboring base, which, you know, I'm not certain I'll be able to find it again. All right, there we go. We have... Do I have all the, uh, the parts? No, I still got some glass. Anyways, we're going to do a few different things, and we're going to head up into space. Kind of at an angle here. Okay, so this is the other base right here. It's a nitrogen farm, right. All right, so into space. And there's a couple of things I want to get done. Now, first of all, my frigate's here. But let's head over to the space station first. Someone mentioned that uh, one of the better ways to get tritium is to just trade with other people in the space station. Not not go to the uh, the trade terminal. No. Other ships that land inside. Go to there. And while I'm in there, I'm going to do a little bit of shopping. Hold on. What do we got? What do we got? A uh, ship that is... Okay. What do you want? Cargo to interloper. What? <laughs> the trader examines my cargo data. They try to appear calm, but they do a poor job. They cannot hide just how keen they are to do a deal. Well, let's see what you got. You have... Not a whole lot of stuff, but, you know, I don't mind taking cactus flesh... ...and gamma root. I'll take that. Whoops. Why don't I take all of it? That's what I meant to do. I don't have anything to sell to you, but you're welcome. Of course, it takes me off course. Back to the space station. So, one thing that I have noticed is I am quite often getting very low on materials for glass. And although... Uh, on the cold planet, on the, the icy cold planet, I have a base for dioxite. Now, I've 
really done nothing with the base, and I'm thinking that's the next one I do, but not in this episode. We'll do that next time. But I do need glass, and I'm thinking one of the most important things for that base is Frostwort. Frostwort is going to be something I need a lot of. Wow. That's shaking. I'm gonna have to go out there and check what's going on. Okay, so let's just go over here. Don't recall if I checked on stuff. Oh, got those. So let's see what we got here. Uh. I'm not sure. I do need a lot more ferrite dust. I always need more ferrite dust. May as well get more chlorine as well, since I'm low on that. Ammonia, I'm... I don't have to worry about that so much. Is there anything I can sell that I don't need right now? There's some things I should just transfer over. Frost crystals... No, I'll hold on to those. Cactus Flesh, I'll move. Gamma Root, I'll move. You... Go to high capacity. Alright. Wow, launch fuel. I've got so much launch fuel. So I've got 406 tritium. And here I've got none. Yeah, none there. And the freighter has none. So that is one thing I need to do, and since I've heard some ships coming in, oh look at this, got an interesting fighter here. There's C-Class, hmm, okay, oh you're a sentinel hunter, huh? Trade, warrior, yeah, let's see what you have. Um, uh, I will take your magnetized ferrite. I'm fine with that. More ferrite dust. But you don't seem to have any tritium. Mm-hmm. Grab the oxygen as well. Let me just see. What am I low on? Well, not exactly low on, but, uh... What... Do I absolutely need? Okay, let's check here. So I need, of course, ferrite. Carbon. Carbon's a big thing. Hmm. Okay. Uranium and copper. I've got a uranium farm set up, don't I? Oh no, I don't have that one set up yet. Never mind. <laughs> okay, let's go talk to you. You with the hauler. You gotta have some tritium, huh? Do you have tritium? Yes, you do. Thank you very much. I'll take your chromatic metal, too. And... Ferrite dust? I'm buying all the ferrite dust I can make. Or... Get. <laughs> make? Oh! The other ships are gone, except you. Hey, I like your ship. Maybe class? Huh. Alright, so what do you have? You have more ferrite dust. Thank you. And... Oh, you're very similar to the other guy. Hmm. Oh, hey, what is this? Well, this is an interesting one. Very interesting shuttle. I kind of like that shuttle. It's a big one. Huh. Well then, let's talk to you. Interloper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it. You, more fairy dust, of course. Hmm, I'll take the pyrite, although I've got a pyrite farm. So 
big deal. All right. Oh, then. It's a starship unoccupied. Uh, sorry, I, I, I know. I accidentally touched your ship. Hey, hey, hey. Hello, another fighter. This is a little beat up, isn't it? Captain Tuluda. What you got? More ferrite dust. More magnetized ferrite. Okay. And your ship is a B-class. 30,000. Wow, look at the inventory in that one. Nice. Okay, let's check you out. You and your shuttle. What's with all the Viking and their shuttles? Or your ancestors. Okay. And... Fairy dust. Thank you. And... More magnetized ferrite. Take more gold. Platinum. Oh, I'm spending. <laughs> I'm spending money. Okay, I think that's decent. So let's just sort this out. I've got way too much stuff here. Silver. Got a high capacity. Look at that. 1105. I'm happy with that. Wait. Did I put it in here? Or did I accidentally put it in Starship Cargo? Oh, silver's there. Mm hmm. Okay. Alright. Platinum. Stick that in the starship. So suit. Okay, we're getting a good amount of this stuff now. That is good and decent. And I don't think of a silicate. But I can uh, make that new one here. There we go. Okay, so we are getting some stuff. Also, someone mentioned I don't need this anymore. 16 units? Really? Oh. I don't need this anymore. Uh, I mean this. And the uh, translator. Actually, I need to install the newest translator. Uh, but... Signal booster. Yeah, I know. I, I never use it, so let's get rid of it. And the portable refiner. You know what? I actually used it in the last episode. <laughs> okay, fine. One last one. Uh, what? That was, that was odd. Okay, we'll see if you've got tritium. Then we'll head back to the ship, and I got something to check out. I'll tell you in a moment what it is. No, you don't. Well, well, okay. That's okay. Let's just move the ferrite dust over. And I've got... Ooh, look at that. 6,097. But pure ferrite is nothing. Almost nothing. Well, since I've got all of that now... I've got some frigate missions to send out. Although... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, uh, you would be... Come on, slow down. Let's check you out. Mighty Starship. Do I tremble at the sight of an exploration vessel? Minus six combat. Minus six. Well, the things improve. I can always get rid of bad ones, you know. Anyways, 
There's another one over here. There you are. Let's see what you are. Oh, you've got a cargo pod right above you. Yes, I would like to add frigates if you have mining. Ugh. Why is there a cargo pod right above you? Now, as for that, now looking at my notes because I do write this stuff down to see what I'm, what I'm run, uh, what I've got, what I don't have, you know. Okay, so rustle of the paper. I do not need more industrial support or trade vessels. I'm looking for combat and exploration. That's that's it right now. Because I've got enough of the other kinds. And you are where? Hey, is that another exploration vessel? Two of them? Well, that would be nice. And it is another science vessel. And this one... Minus two expedition fuel cost, but that's fine. They will improve over time. Okay, so I need to find my... That's a freighter. That's not mine. Where's mine? I think mine is back by the planet. Hold on, let me get out of here. What is it? Oh, jeez. No. No. You said that was an emergency. Ah, there it is. My frigate's over there, and... My frigate. Oh yeah, let's just blaze our way through here. Okay. Let's just get you over here, so I don't have to fly all the way over there. Got those two frigates to rename. Oh, look at that effect. I still think Endurance is a really good update. I just wish I didn't have these performance issues with it. Okay. So, we're back. Now we've got some new ships here. And we're still looking for more combat. So let's see what the new ships are here. Touchy's Hand. What an odd name. Touchy's Hand. So I need to rename this one and this one. So the next ones are the Hayama and Erogawa. Okay, wait a minute. How many exploration vessels do I have now? Three, four, five. Perfect. That's what I need. So this one, we are going to rename. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What was I doing with these? I'm calling EFS. Right. Okay. So this one will be the EFS. Ayama. Again, for those of you who do not know, I am naming these vessels after cities and towns in Japan that I have been to. Okay, and this one is the EFS ah, Warabi. Not Erogawa. Erogawa is actually just part of Tokyo. Okay, there we go. So we've got those, and we have, how many vessels do we have now? So each section is, okay, got nine, 18, and another six is 24. We have room for six more, and they're mainly gonna be combat, as well as uh, organic. All right, so since we have done that, we can now send some missions out. So let's craft more, more, more. 
<laughs> what am I running out of? Uh, tritium. Okay. I got a good amount of it, but yeah. Okay, so what do we have? Navigator Cutty. Seems to have different people each time. Hmm. Okay, this is our longest one. It's a discovery one. Huh. High level of difficulty, so we're going to send our top exploration vessel. Our top two, I would say. And maybe one of the new ones. Let's say the Warabi. Since this is a long one, uh, see which one has the best support available here. Well, we got... These two are pretty good. This one, I think, is best for exploration. And we have one, two combat vessels. I think we'll send... Let me just check for a moment here. Oh, we've got all five. That's fine. Let's get that sent out, because we do have a combat patrol. And this is the next longest, so we need... We're going to need both combat vessels here. The Yamato and the Zama are going out. I think we'll also send this support since it has a fairly decent combat rating. And I think another support would be good. Actually, you have decent combat too, so we'll send the organic out. Fleet rating 4? That's fine. Let's go. Next one, industrial three star. So we need some decent industrial here. Send both of you, as well as this one. Let's do this. Eh, how about this support? I know this is good industrial, but may as well send that support. Is there any low level ones? A second support? There we go just for some uh, experience. Okay, we got some balanced expeditions. I sent out all the combat, so we'll do a support, a trade, industrial exploration, and yeah, I know that one's low. So let's offset that with another one that's fairly decent with Oh, we've got only one more exploration vessel. Mmm. One more trade. That one? Or, yeah, let's send this trade. That's fine. Last one. So we've got industrial, support, exploration, and trade. We've got two that aren't being sent out, which I'm fine with. Alright. They're all out. Oh. So how much fuel do we have left? That much, huh? There we go. Those in order. Uh, also, we've got... Two salvage frigate modules. And I have a feeling that I am waiting on something here. Yeah, I want to do the warp core one here. I could add some of the po base parts, but I think right now having a ship that can travel to any system is really important. Okay. So... I think we should get some uh, ah, ferrite dust. Yes. Okay, so what do we have here that we can put in? So this one's the largest. This one turns into viscous fluid. Okay, let's get that started. And what we're going to do... Ah, I can do this. I can just take this here. 
So, a member of my community has put up a base. I'm guessing here on this planet. Let's see. Okay, welcome back. So, apparently he's got a base somewhat nearby. Aha! Looks like... Wait a minute, I don't see it on there, but I can see it... It said in the system. It's in that direction. Oh, it's right there. Magnetized ferrite and oxygen-free depot. Moon fuzz. Let's go check it out, huh? And it's... Not on the same, same area of the planet. So I need to go up into space. This direction? This direction? Oh. Oh, I still have the uh, space anomaly in, in the system. Okay, so it's... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is it going the wrong way? It should be in this direction. It's... Wait a minute. Oh, it's actually on this side. Really? It's actually really close. Ah, uh, I probably could have walked there. Maybe. But it's a decent distance away, and I actually do invite people to set up their own little bases here. But for me, this is a vacation spot. At least that's what I'm calling it. have rendered in. Oh. What? Okay, now it's... Come on. Come on. You can you can render in. Okay, good. It is. Whew, it took a moment. Uh, two landing spots. Nice. We got a message module here. It says, please take anything you like. Thank you very much. And let's take a look in here. So we've got a whole bunch of Graptino balls. Star bulb. Interesting you got them to grow up there. Hmm. And they're underground. Sure. 60,000 oxygen. That's a lot of oxygen. I don't need... Eh, I don't need that much. Storage is downstairs. Okay. There it is. Okay, so you, we actually have access to storage. Nice. That it's actually underground. Is it underground? Hmm. All right, so how am I doing in ma with magnetized ferrite? 4,500. I can stand another 5,000, but that's all. Wow. That's crazy. Look at that. Oh, let's see. I guess this much. Yeah, that's fine. And the other one is oxygen, which, again, I have eh, fairly, fairly close to a full stack. I'm, I'm fine with that for now. But you got a nice little location here. <laughs> a nice pirate flag there. And you've got power. Let's take a quick look. Let's go on the roof. Okay, 
that looks like the oh that's not power that's uh the pipes you know god you gotta love those things okay i have no idea which direction your power is coming from which is fine but nice little base here i can actually stand on this So, so storage downstairs. Uh, this is stone wall. Oh, interesting. Okay then. So I did get what I need. Thank you very much. And uh, what? Oh, okay. Uh, probably need one of those eventually anyways okay so what we're going to be doing right now I need to actually go over to log and what we're gonna do is this here so automated archive recovery process so I need to go to that station or not stationed to that planet. Interact with the base computer, and I don't believe... I don't know if it's on this planet. It is on this planet. <laughs> That's easy. Still thinking about what kind of design I can do for this. Which would be nice. It would be nice if I could uh, get a good resort. For this region of the galaxy, I'm thinking that the, the worlds or the bases that I want to be, the bigger bases are, of course, uh, the main one on, or the uh, Storm Crystal one, Crystal Storm. And this base here. Archive for user, iteration lost, unavailable, defragmentation continues, no relevant entries found, data scraps available for th synthesis. Archive defragmentation continues, data scraps synthesized, create salvage data. Oh, I got two more salvage data. Nice. So it'll take 24 hours for the archive recovery. Ah. Uh, won't be able to get it right away. Okay. That's fine. I don't have to go over there. Anyways. Yeah. So, since we're here... The next base that we're going to be working on is Perpetual Winter. And here we are. Please tell me you you did park inside the building. Awful, awful at parking, aren't I? <laughs> okay, so we do want to find dioxite. So I'm keeps telling me to turn around. Okay, so I may as well go off in this direction and check it out. Gonna be way over here. Ugh. If I can find a power hotspot nearby, that'll be wonderful. Because uh, that that makes it easier for me for the next episode. The so next episode is going to be building this thing. Hello. Hi. You have a kind of a cute face. Very. Like Bambi like. Alright, come on, come on. Over here. It wants me going in circles. So what are you? Are you dioxide? You are. That is perfect. Save beacon. Okay, so my as a landed pilot. Huh. 364. 
So, let me just check. No nearby hotspot. Mm. Apparently there is one in this direction. I'm guessing. Sorry! I thought you were chasing me for a moment. But, uh, no, I didn't mean that. And that ship is gone. Oh well. Ha. Ah. I think I'm gonna have to look for another location. It's quite honestly, it, this is getting a little too far. So, yeah. No power hotspots. Well, that's okay. I... I am gonna have to do some searching... I'm just curious what this beacon is. I don't recall putting down a save beacon. So I'm gonna just check that out. And then I'll return back here. Well, not here. Hello, hello. Scanning some plants here, too. Okay, where are you? There it is. I have to go into space. Okay. Now, I don't know if I put that save beacon down. Or... Someone else did. This is odd. Hold on, someone built a base here. is this? What is this? Mmm, it's not fully rendered in. This is not fully rendering. Oh, there we go, there we go. Whose base is this? Mysterious. Kleena. Okay, there we go. What do we have here? C-Class Explore. Eh. It's not going to give much in terms of... Uh, money, is it? No, it's not. But this is a surprise. Now, I don't know who Kleena is. But, I mean, I discovered this planet, so my question is, do they watch my videos? Kleena, let me know. Because... I'm a little surprised. I did not expect this. Well, it's an interesting surprise. Anyways. Let's use this. And, uh, where was it? Let's go back here. Alright, we're back here. We've got no power. <laughs> Which is fine. Eventually we are going to have power. Alright. So, next time, I am going to rebuild this thing in another location. I'm going to find a spot where I can uh, tap into some energy as well as get dioxide. I know this is dioxide here and... I never use these things. I mean, they're really not that good, are they? Alright, 
So, I'd like to thank you for joining me on this great adventure. Check out the playlist on the right in case you missed any episodes. Consider subscribing if you like what you see. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.